Tis the season to be hungry. Let's rate some food options to nom this holiday season. We hope you brought your appetite. We'll start with dessert first. Festivities are nothing without cookies. Baking cookies is no cakewalk. How do Mrs. Harper's treats hold up? What's so funny? Nothing, it's just, you know, a break from making cookies. You're just following a recipe, right? Just following a recipe? Let's see if Mr. Harper has what it bakes. No, no, no! God! Oh. That was a claws catastrophe. Who says turkey is only good for Thanksgiving? This bird and its fixings are perfect to headline any dinner. It might make you a little bit tired, though. More thick, heavy gravy. Would you kids mind if we, uh, if we, uh... If you went to bed? Not at all. <laughs> good night. Love Sweet dreams. Have a great sleep. Let's rate it. I love you guys. Love okay. you. Now a homemade soup made by the Harper siblings. What's even in that? Did you really think that dirty socks, toilet water, belly button lint, Ted flies, moldy cottage cheese, dental floss gunk, and a sprig of dill was gonna smell good? I thought the dill would jazz it up. How are we supposed to get mom and dad to drink this? You'll get kicked out if you serve this at a dinner party. The Harpers are always bringing something new to the table. Could any of these original food creations make a holiday dinner plate? A waffle with falafel in it. <laughs> the waffle falafel. Deal with that. The fapita. Deal with it. But meat. The pizza dilla. Two slices of pizza slapped together to make a quesadilla. Boom. <laughs> the kebab gobbler. Turkey and all the fixings. It's Thanksgiving on a stick. Boom. I dropped this, but I respect my cookware too much. Those dishes all look delicious. But what if they were combined? The kebab gobbler waffle falafel fapita pizza dilla. Dia. Let it go. <laughs> Nikki, as the closest thing we have to a chef, what do you think? I think it's a mishmash of 11 different foods on a stick. I think it's a culinary abomination. <laughs> That's a good name. But here's a better one. The food bat. That's a home run. Here's a gentle reminder that not every food combination needs to be tried. Check it out. You can dip anything in the chocolate fountain. I dipped the taco. Oh, chocolate meat! Chocolate meat! Here's another food combo you don't see every day. Who's ready for waffle burgers? Wait, that actually looks good. Now for a classic hearty dish. Meatloaf with mashed potatoes and gravy. Now this is a heavy dish, so rather than pairing with a fuller bodied whole milk, I suggest oh. going with a well chilled skim. <laughs> but as always, my recommendation is, pack your own lunch. Fried mac and cheese balls. No one on earth can resist. I can smell the nachos. And I can smell the mac and cheese. Sorry, man. Sometimes art can be edible. How about a brown rice teddy bear with an omelet blanket? It says so much by saying so little. I call it? Go to Betty, Teddy. <laughs> Not only is it creative, but it looks good enough to eat. Good enough to eat, huh? Of course, someone's been eating them. Who would stoop so low as to take a child's art project and eat it? Betty Teddy would make a nice holiday centerpiece. Or a little snack. So your taste buds aren't feeling too festive. We've got a meal idea just for you. Just make sure you have a strong stomach. You need to go slow. Too late. The Papa Grande is in Papa Tom now. Well, you're going to be popping buttons if you don't stop all this eating. Mm. I can't believe you don't have a stomach ache by now. Funny. When you've got a stomach of steel like that, That's new. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah I'm fine. It's past. Okay. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> so, you, uh, you want to split a Mexican chocolate? Oh! 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 Okay, honey, Whoa. Honey, just just oh. breathe through it, okay? okay. <gasps> 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 
Aged cheese can be a nice appetizer before the main course. Just make sure it isn't too aged. I've got some nice aged cheese, including a Danish blue. Don't be afraid of the veins. It's very approachable. <laughs> the only cheese I approach is nacho. <sighs> Don't feel bad, Nikki. It's not your fault. <laughs> cheese me, bro. This is so not approachable. Looking for a very versatile food? You can serve waffles for breakfast, lunch, dinner, or a snack. That's a holiday miracle. That means I'm enjoying my food. Well, now I'm not enjoying my food. Well, then you should be chewing like this. I want in on this. Hold on. What is wrong with you people? During this celebratory season, if you're looking for good food, we suggest sticking to the classics. You apps, a hearty dinner, and of course, dessert. Or if you're feeling adventurous, throw it all on a stick.